Rima hat gar nicht geantwortet. Vor zwei Tagen hat sie mir dann gesagt, äh, sie sei krank und dass sie dann bald wieder hier sein guten wird. Tag. Aber sie ist gut ah, Tag, Sonja, guten Tag. So. so, jetzt, Recording hat angefangen. Schön, dann was mal sehen, was können wir jetzt gleichzeitig schaffen. Der Mutter sah fehlt, der wird auch gleich kommen. Inzwischen kann ich alles einstellen. Hm? Ja, ich glaube, ihr könnt jetzt meinen Bildschirm sehen. Ja? Ja, so. Das war's. Hm. So, hoffentlich ist das klar genug. Also ja, alles, was wir, ja, alles, was wir hier in dem Kasten sehen, the box, hier, äh, sind Wendungen, die wir brauchen, wenn wir sagen wollen, was der Arzt macht oder was der Patient macht, je nachdem. Äh, wir können mal diese Wendungen lesen. Und sehen, ob wir alle Wendungen hier verstehen. Gibt es etwas, das nicht verständlich ist? Sonst ist hier nichts zu machen. Ein Rezept abholen. So, das ist Seite Nummer? Das ist 32. Also, okay. Danke schön. Ja, Arbeitsbuch bitte. Ja. Nach dem Befinden fragen, was bedeutet das hier? Äh, Rezept abholen, ich glaube, es, äh, das versteht ihr schon. Was bedeutet ein Rezept holen, abholen? Du fährst ja Rezept. Das Rezept. Receipt. Ja? Uh, to, to fetch a prescription. Receipt. Nein, nein, prescription. Prescription, what the doctor writes. Yeah, Rezept here is not a receipt. It's the prescription that is written by a doctor. That is called a Rezept. That's Rezept. In this context, in the medical context. It's like the doctor telling a patient, ich schreibe Ihnen ein Rezept, bitte nehmen Sie die Tabletten regelmäßig. Oder nehmen Sie die Medikamente, die Medizin regelmäßig. Hmm? So, Rezept, das Rezept, it's a prescription. So, den Blutdruck messen. So, to measure the BP? Ja, yeah. messen ist ein starkes Verb, messen, maß, gemessen. Hmm? Nach dem Befinden fragen. Bedeutet denn das hier? Nach dem Befinden fragen. So, if you have, have some questions to ask, let us know. Also, wie geht es zum Beispiel? Wie geht es? Seit gestern. Du warst gestern krank und wie geht es heute? Also, ich frage nach dem Befinden. Du oh. ask about someone's health. How one is feeling, zum Beispiel. Ja, sich befinden, also your own position, your own location, your own health. So you're asking about somebody's health. Das bedeutet nach dem Befinden fragen. Ich frage nach dem Befinden äh, des Kindes heute. Nach dem Befinden des Patienten heute. Äh, ja, ähm, eine Spritze bekommen. So to get injected. Yes, ein Medikament einnehmen. 
to take the medicine to buy the medicine nay to take it ingest i name it to put it in your mouth ingest it okay uh sich auf die waage stellen this you have to do in every doctor's place so waga sir some wings ke wings ke sir yes so sich auf die waage stellen to measure your weight you have to take your weight to stand on the scales yes sir hmm, to stand on the scales okay the diagnose stellen so to diagnose yeah to make a diagnosis um and what else is there den überkörper frei machen so to remove the shirt to remove one shirt yeah free oh. your upper part of the body einen termin vereinbaren ich vereinbare einen termin mit dem arzt to set up a meeting yeah an appointment okay, okay. so to arrange okay. actually Need to fix. For an baron is to agree upon or to fix. For prescribe, ah, yeah, a medicament prescribing. To prescribe medicine. To prescribe a medicine. medicine. Yeah. Sich eine Überweisung geben lassen. What is this here? So Überweisung is identity, sir. Yeah, ID. Hmm? You guys on the ID? Are you sure? No, sir. I'm not. It's been this just transfer. Wo ausweis hoti hai wo ausweis. Sir transfer. Yeah. Sir to transfer again now. To transfer. Yes. Hmm. So what does it mean? Sir, China, you guys on the given last. Sir transfer. Uh, transfer to another department or another well hospital. Well done, friends. ये तो doctor ही समझ सकता था. To give a referral to another doctor or another department. Yeah, so in the doctoral context, जी शायद ना युवा वासों वाइजों की इन लसन की इन लसन. This is the patient saying. The patient allows himself to be transferred to another doctor. The doctor says. I think you should go to this specialist, the cardio or the neuro or uh, to the nephro or the what's why say. So to give a transfer, literally not a bank transfer here, the patient is transferred or referred to another department. This is medical terminology here. I'm decision. I'm that set out Stellen. To place out a receipt. दिखाना मतलब प्रिस्क्रिप्शन दिखाना बनाना लिटरली प्रिस्क्रिप्शन So to pull out the ah, pull out the tooth or pull out a tooth. A dentist does that. What do these pictures mean here? This right shown. Yeah. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three. Actually, ah, eight. Yeah, sorry. So I'll take his medicament, Nenan. Which is which? As to build D tablet phones. Phones D tablet. The phones, yes, sir. Phones, sir. Phones. Yeah. So you're starting here. Yeah. Okay. D tablet. There's zaft, sir. Fear, uh, zwite is uh, there's zaft. There's zaft. Okay. And uh, sir, spritz, sir. Zeben. Spritz, sir. Zeben. हम्म या दस फ्लास्टर सर आप नाइन 
मीनिंग ऑफ जाल्ब Give me a give me a synonym in English for ointment. It sounds very much like zalb. So, so creams or ointment. Zalb. S a l v e. Yes, sir. Zalb. S a l v e. It's very close to the German salve in English. Salve, S A L V E. It's the same as ointment. Ointment is more um, has more usage than the word salve. S A L V E. Hmm? Okay. What's Bedoiten? These are Vyota here. Would you be able to tell me own of Vyota book? Also, eine Packungsbeilage zum Beispiel ist ein Zettel mit wichtigen Informationen, der in einer Schachtel mit Medikamenten liegt. So, was bedeutet Schachtel? Case, Box, Packing. So the pakung, the word pakung itself means a hilla, a cover, a container, the hilta, order, a box, a small, narrow, thin paper, cardboard box, shachtel. This can be ointment at the normally. Oh, I'm not going to open it. That's not it. Must be in another room. Yeah. So what is what size then? Neben Wirkung then. Neben Wirkung then. What is Wirkung? And then hat man die Bedeutung gefunden. Nebenwirkungen. Sir, is effect, and ja. neben is, uh, close. Uh, uh. Huh? Sir, is effect that I know. Neben is very close or beside or next like that. Ha, 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 ha. Bolo, 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 bolo. Side effects. Side effects, can now. Next. Zinc verkungen. If you want it in the dictionary language, the uh, side verkungen. Effect. Yeah, the neben the uh, the haupt verkungen, einen Patienten irgendwie um, auf die Patienten wirken können. Extra verkungen. Manchmal, manchmal auch. Um, unerwünschte, undesirable. That's a side effect. And what is Wechselwirkung? So Wechsel bedeutet change, and Wirkung mm -hmm. is effect. Yeah. Exchange effect or something. Change. Change. Wechsel is change. 
Vexil virkum is the interactions of medicine sometimes. Interactions or interdependencies. So when a, a doctor prescribes a medicine, it's not just uh, the nabin virkum that the doctor has to be careful about, but also the interdependencies of that medicine on the patient. So it can be some something like Gagan Zaitika Vexel Virkung, the mutual interdependencies, because of the composition, chemical composition of the medicamenta. Maybe Jayans can explain that better. Yes, sir. With many yeah. medications, we can't we can't prescribe two medications together. It is many, many times the case. Yeah. So, even even uh, with COVID vaccine, we can't give diclofenac. Right. Oh, and diclofenac is a painkiller. Yes, sir. This is for the others who are not familiar with the name diclofenac. Diclofenac, given in veterinary medicines earlier, which is now banned, was the cause of the decline of vultures in India. This is the reason we don't see any vultures in India, almost nil, almost all over India. In any, in any case, South India, no vultures at all. Reason being diclofenac, acting on the kidneys of the vultures, which they got affected because diclofenac was given to cattle and the dead cattle were then fed upon by vultures and it affected their kidneys. They were wiped out, one go. Okay, Anwendungsgebiet. Uses area. 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 Yeah. Huh? And Anwendung? Usage. Yeah, so tell me, uh, can you explain that? What is an Anwendungsgebiet? It's with medicines. So the prop the proper place to use it. Mm, no. No, not quite. Anwendungs Gebiet. Uh, <clears throat> one is the area of application. If you're looking at uh, Let's say in medicine. So what are all the possible areas in which this medicine can be used? Okay, I said roots of uh, taking medication. Yeah. So in, like oral oh, route, injectable route. Uh, no, that will not be that. No, think of scope of application or even application range. Where all okay, can be Local on skin. Ha. Huh. That way, yes. Intramuscular, intravenous, uh, external use only, etc., etc. Hmm? That is the root of medication, sir. Only. Oh, it's called root, is it? Okay. Name alam yes, sir. Medical term, medical term. Okay. Next one. Varn hinweiser. Warnings. Warnings. Not to be taken if. Or to be taken only under uh, consultation, Schedule H. Hmm? Okay. Dosier rooms, un, uh, un, uh, unlighted, sorry. Sir, dosage. Uh, thought of some missing, but unlighting. Dosage is correct, but I want the full word, then you can shorten it. Mm -hmm. Instructions, dosage instructions. Dosage instructions is good. You could do zero. Overdose. Overdose sage. Noun. 
ne, overdose age literally. So Vorsichtsmaßnahmen. Careful management. Uh, management. Yes, sir. Simple word. Precautions. Precautions, yeah. <laughs> literally, literally, Vorsicht means caution. Vorsicht, Vorsicht, caution. Bitte Achtung, Achtung, bitte. Maßnahmen, measures. So, cautionary measures or measures to ob observe, to be cautious about. Agar ulta meaning dekho, hamesha ulta hi dekhna chahiye. Then it works out to one word in English, precautions. Medical terminology. The Damit Manda Svashti. Manchman gives us out medicament in Indian. The uh also uh, we also in we also in uh, in the importieren. Or we are exporting of this medicament on of the settle that you see inside which is enclosed, the Pakungs by Lager. There will be these dosage instructions and other things given in different languages. And one of the languages used sometimes is English. I mean, is German. Have you ever noticed that? Next time, <clears throat> before you take a <coughs> take medicine, especially that the one that comes in packing or packages, uska packungs by lager dekho. You normally have everything written on that. Your Nebenwirkungen and uh, these are unlightened, dosirungs, unlightung, and what, what to do in case there's an overdosage. It's sub It's the composition bhi hoga. So Zamin Zetsu is a composition. Warn uh, Hinweiser, other state of these settle. And sometimes, depending on the export, that medicine has all these instructions written in other foreign languages. And I have this much more of of Deutsch to see. Okay, then this I don't want to do, but I need to do this one. As in Rede Vendung, then. Is my grammar come here? We just relax over the weekend. But the Deutschen, these are Rede Vendung. So what are these uh, idiomatic phrases here? Da gibt es nichts zu lachen. Du kannst gut lachen. Wer zuletzt lacht, lacht am besten. Die Sonne lacht. Dass ich nicht lache. Du Wir wirst auch bald Probleme haben. Yeah. Then C will come. Where will C come from? That means it's going to be a very simple problem. Where? Where will you match? Sir, this is the third question. So... This one? No, sir. It's the first one. It's the first one. Do, so, I have in this first sentence, sir. Nine. Nine. That gives us nichts zu lachen. You have to match the columns, uh, and other. Literally translated, Jayant. There's nothing to laugh here. Give this next to lesson. Go about me, Toto. This on a luck. Seit gestern lacht die Sonne bei uns hier in Hyderabad. Seit gestern lacht die Sonne bei uns hier in Hyderabad. Da 
Davor hatten wir viel Regen gehabt. Es hat viel geregnet. Und seit gestern lacht die Sonne. So, A. A ist richtig. A ist richtig, absolut. Es herrscht strahlender Sonnenschein. So, also was, was bedeutet herrscht? Herrschen has got various meanings. The first meaning a dictionary would give you is rules. Rule. The king is ruling. Uh, or the present government is ruling. The other meaning here of Hessian in this context is to, to prevail. So now the absolutely brilliant sunshine is prevailing. Hey, we have like literally Hessian. It is ruling the sky. The sun is ruling the sky now. In the Pele, the Badal, Badalon ka Raj tha, ab Suraj nikal aya hai, ab Suraj Raj kar raha hai, literally. Word for word, agar usko dekhoge, Hershen, to rule, a king rules. So as Hersh, strahlender, beaming, shining. So the Zona lacht, it's a colloquial phrase. So, 4A is richtig. So, zweite is A. Du hast oder du kannst gut lachen? Yes, sir. Du bist in einer besseren Situation als ich. Ich denke. Ja, ist korrekt. Ah, bhai. Kya kou, tum to hasoge. Ja, tum, tum hasoge, tum has sakte ho. Das bedeutet, du bist in einer besseren Situation als ich. So, dritte ist der uh, Pause. Es ist uh, wichtig, wer am Ende Erfolg hat. Ja, das ist richtig. The one who loves last, loves the best. Ja. Yeah. That means, das ist nicht it, what matters is, who, who is it who has been successful at the end? And so on. Okay, there's only two, one, two left. Or three, actually. Das ist nicht lache. Dir wird das Lachen noch vergehen. Dir wird das Lachen noch vergehen. What is this vergehen? I'm sure you'll know. So what's predicted for you? Your laughter will also... So go away. Go away. Fade away. Ha. So dear with this luck and not forgiven. So, was ein anderer erzählt hat, ist falsch. Nein, 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 nein. Das muss man erst nehmen. What's in play? Du wirst auch bald Probleme haben. Mari, ich sehe, wie er wieder kommt. Ah, du wirst auch bald Probleme haben. Haslo, haslo. बड़ी जल्दी तुम्हारी हंसी भी खत्म हो जाएगी गायब हो जाएगी तो बेस्ट आउट बाल प्रॉब्लम हाफन नाउ टू नाउ यू कैन फिनिश लागेब से नीचे सो लाखन नथिंग टू लाफ एट हियर बास आई नो अंदर एक्सेल्ड हार्ट इज फाल्स नहीं फाल्स बस बिल्कुल नहीं फाल्स बस बिल्कुल एंस Das muss man ernst nehmen. Was bedeutet das ernst hier? Ja. 
Ernst nehmen bedeutet to take seriously. To take something seriously. Okay. So da gibt es nichts zu lachen. Hier koi hasne wali baat nahi hai. That means okay. yes, serious part. So take it seriously. Yeah. Nothing to laugh at. So take it seriously. Das muss man ernst nehmen. Ich meine das im Ernst. I mean it seriously. Yeah, the word ernst, serious. Und dass ich nicht lache. Don't make me laugh. That means, usne kuch kahani sunai hai, kuch aisa anekdote oder sowas erzählt hat. Und das finde ich nicht homophol. Das ist total falsch. Jo, was sage ich um mich? Ja, so was ein anderer erzählt hat, ist falsch. 5D. Das ist nicht. Also, ich muss jetzt gehen, so. Okay, okay, Andrada. Tschüss, eine schön, schöne Zeit. Also. Ist nicht so viel Süßigkeiten. Ja, so, ich will nicht, so. Okay. So. Danke sehr, Sir. Auf Wiedersehen. Bitte. Ja, bis Montag. Ein schönes Wochenende. Yes, sir. So, I'll keep hearing when I get ready, Sir, but I'll not attend, but I'll, I'll keep on hearing, Sir. Ja, sure, sure. If okay. possible, if possible. Yes. Okay. So, pantomimisch machen wir das leider nicht, denn wir haben unsere Kameras ausgeschaltet. Was bedeuten diese Verben? Gähnen, niesen, Seufzen, weinen, grinsen, husten. Sir, husten ist zu kaff, weinen ist zu karakrei. Ja. Grinsen ist zu grin. Grin, ja. Du hast ein Foto mit der Rechte. Und niesen ist zu snies. Ja. Da war ich. Gähnen macht man, wenn man sehr müde ist oder kurz vor dem Schlafen. Wenn man schlafen möchte oder wenn man schlafen will, dann gähnt man. Join. Join. Jogern. Ja, Join. Y-A-W-N. Join. Das ist gähnen. Ja, to yawn. Und was ist seufzen? It's something to do with breathing. To inhale or exhale. Yes, but for a, at a particular time, at a particular moment, or for something, for something that you um, you have to do, because maybe it's so freedom. One is uh, so freedom. Then zweifs man. Okay. Yes, is the arbeit zu Ende. Das ist zweifsen. So freedom zweifsen. Like you would probably do that when you come out of the OT or when you come out of a difficult uh, session with a patient. Successfully? Yes, satisfied? Hmm. To exhale with the... I mean, that it's hmm. done, accomplished. Ha. So then you let your breath out. So that's a satisfied sigh. S-I-G-H. That's a zoifzen. Zoifsen tab bhi hota hai jab koi patient dard mein ho. That is also zoifsen. That groaning. 
I'm sure you would have experienced it every day now. Yes, sir. <laughs> not so. Uh, not so. Kya uh, batao? I'll say, this is wife's son. That groaning. So, I mean, uh, breath is also groaning. Aari hai, matlab. Ha. This is also wife's son. It can also be something that you let your breath out, out of the tension, free, freeing the tension to sigh. S I G H. Very contentedly, sabi, sab khush hai, sab thik hai. Ha, huh. okay. Chalo, ab batao bhai. Next patient, please. No, something on those lines. Or uh, like Murtaza, a difficult problem solved. Subay se laga hua wo technical issue pe. An amender hotter than das gilius. So normally, wo it's saas, thandi saas or whatever you want to say. You let go. Okay. Done. That is why I've seen. The picture, of course, is showing Grinzen. That's a Grinzen. I say, photo may allow me to have a passport photo. Mein. You're not supposed to grin. Okay. There's an interesting uh, lexion here. Ganz interesting lexion. You will laugh on the writer. Our before we are done the election reason, this is done here. I'd like to do a few of these verbs here. With prefixes. Remember, this is a problem area. Then, sobald we are the prefix, am Anfang anhängen, ändert sich die Bedeutung des Verbs. That's this, and we, we have shown von um, rufen, anrufen, schreiben, unterschreiben, holen, wiederholen, suchen, besuchen. So the moment we add a prefix, the verb changes in meaning. So, konsa prefix in verbs may lagega? An, aus, ein, mit, unter, fer, fer. Zweimal. I give you a word of advice. And in that here, don't attach a meaning to the prefix. Because the meaning might change when we use the same prefix with another verb. I can give you a couple of hints. Aus normally means out. Ein, in. Mit is along. Um, but that's it. The first ka for treat. Lakhan is kisunun for treat dish natsal. The tribe. The tribe. Oh, yes, sir. For tribe. The tribe. As a was predicted for tribe. To relieve. To relieve is good. Nay to bhagadena. To drive away. Bhagadena. So if you laugh, laugh, laughing is healthy, healthy and laughter drives away all pain. Vertreibt the Schmerzen. So vertreiben in this context bedeutet weg machen. Also what is then this here? La beim Lachen atmet man aus. Aha. Ein Ein is richtig. Sir, but breathe out, uh, breathe in, guys. Sense in English. वो बहुत हँसे छूटती है यार. उसके बाद सांस लेनी पड़ती है ना? तो बाइन लाखन आठ पद मन थीफा आइन. 
Ja? Okay. Dabei schüttet das Gehirn, Gehirn, the brain. Glückhormon aus. Aus ist gut. Aus. So ausschütten, ausschütten. To shoot out, shoot out, to release. Shake, out. shake, shake. To shake, schütten bedeutet shake. Ja, bottle, bottle, was ist Chatkarna, Bahar Nikalna, shake karke, hila karke. So that is Sir, shooting. In English, how are released? Hormones are released. Hormones are released. So, this is how are released. Shake out. Shake out in that sense, yes. The correct word, of course, you have to okay. translate depending on the language. This is how translate it. Hmm? Okay. The gelotology. Ah, this is interesting. What is gelotology? What's right in uh, gelotology? Malume? Psychology? Study of laughter. Nahi, study of laughter. Laughter research. What the psych? Okay. Laughter research. Uh, how would I put it? Lach for Shung. लोगों को हंसी कब आती है क्यों आती है कैसे आती है सर्वे या दैट इज द स्टडी ऑफ दैट इज कॉल्ड गैलोटोलॉजी ओडा लाख फॉर शोंग लोगोस ओडा लोगी ओडा लोगोस बेडोइटेड स्टूडियर स्टडी स्टडी ऑफ इट्स अ ग्रीक सफिक्स लोगोस बायोलॉजी या सो बायोलॉजी Biology, logos, study of bio, body, human life. So study of life, biology. Oology, o comes from the word egg, ova, ovum, Latin. So logi, logos, study of the eggs, oology. So that is oology. So logos study and here gelos gelotos is laughter. So it's a study of laughter. So this will be easy for you now. The gelotology zucht. What's the prefix? Verzucht the verzucht. Nine nine verzucht is wrong. It doesn't try. Verzuchen is to try. It's a study. Unter, untersucht. Untersucht. The Gelotology untersucht. Untersuchen was the right word. Untersuchen. Determines. They are asked untersucht the patienten. Okay, examine. Examine. Iske two sir medlo hai ek. इसलिए दो होते हैं ना एक में होता है एक दूसरे होता है रिसर्च करते हैं जो उसके में होता है हाँ लेकिन वो रिसर्च भी तो एक तरह का एग्जामिनेशन ही हो गया ना तो एग्जामिनिंग समथिंग मोर माइन्यूटली बारीकी से देख रहे हो तो वो भी तो उनका जुकम हो गया ना एक्सपेरिमेंटियल एंसोमाइज़ � Laughter research examines, tests uh, the effect of laughter on the body and the psyche, the mind. That is Lach for Schrung. <coughs> Good. Aage badho. Aria ghar paunch gaya? Seven about to reach in five minutes. Okay. Sir, I remember mentioned Farzukhan 9 and Lakh Therapy. 
correct. And Vaita. Diesel art therapy, Kanman, medicine is uh, sinful, sinful, uh, unwinded. Is correct. What is unwinded? To use. To use, to apply. Yeah, it can be used medically. Can one Sir, Vendon? Vendon is to turn. Uh, Vendon is to turn. turn. Okay. To turn. Peter Om Vendon, Page Palto. Peter Vendor on the police side. Go to, uh, turn to the police side. Approach the police side. Go to the police. Uh, when then un, you turn to and go there. So here, unwenden, with the prefix unwenden to apply. Ungevanta physique, ungevanta shemi, applied physics, applied chemistry. Last one, yeda kan bayam lach yoga. Mitamaka. Mitmachen. It's very popular in Rajkal. This laughter therapy. But I don't know whether forced laughter is good for the health. What I don't like is that it doesn't get out Spontaneous laughter is something different. This is minor minor. I have nothing to say. <coughs> so, why do we do the whole long? We're continuing our Partizip perfect revision. Upholen, absetzen, bestellen, durchlesen, einnehmen, vergessen, verschreiben. So, einige Verben hier sind nicht trennbar. Which ones? Vergessen, verschreiben, und, uh, ja, bestellen. Verschreiben, vergessen und bestellen. Bestellen. Also drei, bestellen, <coughs> vergessen und verschreiben. And meaning please, sentence when da lo für meaning, asani sa thamne. Let's start with, also was bedeutet das hier? Ich habe meine Tabletten regelmäßig eingenommen. I have been taking my tabs regularly. Taking is a good Einnehmen. Taking in. Taking in. Wo matlab thoda saaf ho gaya. Others taking is correct. Good English. Agreed. But taking in. मतलब खाना आई नेम इन टैबलेट एंड आई नेम इन टैबलेट खा लेना सो दैट वी डोंट फॉरगेट द मीनिंग ओके लेट्स ट्राई ये वाला ते आज साथ मेरा इन्हें नॉइस मेडिकमेंट फर्स्ट राइड में ओ हो हेलो हेलो पार्टिसिप्स वाई क्या है श्राइबन का श्रीबन श्राइबन श्रीब ये श्रीबन याद है यह हवा एंड ब्रीफ ये श्रीबन सो श्राइबन श्रीब ये श्रीबन प्रेफिक्स इस फेर सो नो गे देर आज हटनिया एन नॉइस मेडिकमेंट Verschreiben. 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 Perfekt. Okay. Um, okay, okay. Aha. Ye tino exact me lo. Ye tino ka exact banta hai yaan pe. The apothecarian. What is an apotheker? The apothecary, the apothecary, drugist, 
Yeah, just for the pharmacist. Hmm? Okay, had this Neuer medicament, etc., etc. Gestern habe ich S, that is this medicament, in der Apotheke, something, something. Und zu Hause habe ich gleich die Packungsbeilage of this medicament, etc. Sir, so the apotheker uh, uh, had the new medicament abgesat. Uh, Nein. Nein. Setzen ka sir, mein bolliya baati si kya tha. Setzen, zaps. Setzen. That's the first step. Second step is gestern habe ich dieses Medikament in der Apotheke and Britons. So how the habe ich gleich? The packings by lager. Absetzen. Durchlesen. Durch. Uh... Separable. Separable. Ten bar. Doesn't ten bar is there? Absetzen. Durchgelesen. Durchgelesen. What is the packings by lager? Bulge. Yes, sir. Wo, uski jo covering hai. Haan. Wo jo andar jo paper aata hai na uske saath. Har packing ke andar ek paper hota hai. Any packed medicine will have this paper. Compulsory hai wo. As per international law. The composition of the medicine, warnings, all details I have, are written on this packings by lager. Das ist ein Zettel mit wichtigen Informationen. Agar zyada le liya to kya karna chahiye? Agar wo medicine, for example, it's some, some ointment or something, galti se aankho mein chala gaya. Kya karna chahiye? Immediate first aid. Of course, last mein likha rata hai, and I'm, um, so I'm asking and all that. Or untersuch and lassen. But immediate first aid, us mein likha hoga. <laughs> so, we have the packings by lager to house Deutschkelesen. So, the apotheker had this Neuer medicament bestellt. She placed an order for this medicine. Das war nicht im Lager. Bestellen ka mitlab. To order, place an order for that. Bestellen ka mitlab. Okay. Bestellen, to order. Aha, yes sir. Yes sir, yes sir. Wo restaurant mein bestellen nahi karte. Das war nicht im Lager. Place. Das war nicht yeah. vor Yeah. Right. So sie hat das neue Medikament bestellt. Und gestern habe ich es in der Apotheke. Ye abholen, abgeholt. Abgeholt, abgeholt. So, Hause habe ich gleich die Packungsbeilage durchgelesen. Hat ich dies so vorhige, Bull. Ich habe. Ich habe vergessen. Vergessen. Auch noch Kopfschmerztabletten zu kaufen. So, Bajakia. Yes. Absetzen. Absetzen. So when you read the sentence, can you tell me the meaning of absetzen? Hello? Vegan. To not take in, not take it. 
अलग कर देना हटा देना निकाल देना बगल में रख देना ich habe die Abtabletten wegen der Nebenwirkungen. Nebenwirkung, Side Effects. So these tablets, because of the side effects, meine Hatadie, abgesetzt. Und der Arzt hat mir ein neues Medikament verschrieben. So ihr Pura Abjolo, ich running text back back. Ich habe ein Tablet regelmäßig eingenommen. Dann gab es Probleme mit diesen Tabletten und äh, ich habe diese Tabletten wegen der Nebenwirkungen abgesetzt. Ich bin zum Arzt gegangen und ihm alles darüber erzählt. Er hat mir ein neues Medikament verschrieben. Dann ging ich in die Apotheke. Die Apothekerin sagte mir, sie haben dieses Tab äh, Medikament nicht mehr im Lager. Und sie hat das neue Medikament sofort bestellt. Und gestern habe ich es in der Apotheke abgeholt. Zu Hause angekommen, habe ich gleich die Packungsbeilage durchgelesen. Aber ich habe leider, ich habe vergessen, leider auch noch Kopfschmerzen-Tabletten zu kaufen. Ich habe das dann im Text Yeah, and remember these words, they can be used in other contexts also. We were practicing participle perfect. The rule for participle perfect, when do verbs not take a GE? Yeah, right? Untrennbar. Can you give me some of the prefixes? Sir, uh, de, ge, miss, and mm -hmm. emp are for sir. Gut, well done. Well done. Yeah, yeah, Raklena. No gay in such cases. Okay. Do you remember, still remember how to form imperatives at sir? Yes, sir. Z uh, form to both is here. Do form me kar sakte ho? Normally do me nahi huzo kari. Sir, it's me ST. ST nahi hoga or do nahi hoga. The pronoun do yes, will disappear and the st will also disappear. For example, ye dono nikal do. Leg. Then reflexive hai. So do form a dish either. So leg dish bitter him. Zets. Sir, bitter will be the do form me. No, 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 no problem. No problem. No problem. No problem. No problem. Koi has nahi hai. Imperative hai, but okay. imperative can still be polite, na? Yes, sir. Yeah, so, leg dish bitte hin. Um leg jau wa pe, tone apna badal jate hai. Yeah, so, I'm sure you can use all uh, the sentences here. Ein massieren. Salba ein massieren. So, was ist ein Massier? To measure the... Hey, to hey. measure... Are, Salbe! Salbe! Hallo, hallo! Das ist eine Salbe hier. Salbe. Acha, ha, ha, ha. Okay, okay. Ah! Ah! To apply, to apply. Give me a word, a great word. Mm -hmm. To rub. Ein. To rub in. To rub it in. Or use the word with mass. Massage it in. Literally. Oh, yes, sir. Yes, sir. Massage kar to way usko skin ke andar jane do. Ain masir and to rub it in, to massage it in. Sir, but an masir in nahi hona ki wajah skin ke upper karte hai. Skin ke andar jane ki. Andar jane ki. Aray, andar chala jata hai na? 
वो तो तुमको मालूम है सम मेडिसिन गो इन देर अब्सॉर्ब थ्रू द स्किन राइट फॉर एग्जाम्पल द मोस्ट फेमस एंड मोस्ट कॉमन वन इज आयोडेक्स रब करने से के बाद वो अंदर जाता है स्किन के इंग्लिश में हम कभी इंग्लिश में हम कभी इन नहीं यूज करते ऑन यूज मसाज नहीं करते हाई यू रब इट ऑन द स्किन बिकॉज आफ्टर यू रब इट देर इट गोज इन द स्किन टेक्स इट इन साइड वेर एज द जर्मन वन इज लुकिंग एट दिट पार्ट ऑफ वॉट है नॉट अन it goes in what is unhalten to hold on yes to hold your breath unhalten to stop saans lo ruko with the ein sir luft air nahi hoti luft air hoti hai na luft air hai ha to matlab is isme ye nahi aana chahiye aat mein unhalten marzi hai breath ब्रेड तो वो होती है ना आटमेन आटमेन नहीं बोलेगा आटमेन इज सोल आटमेन इज आत्मा सोल होता है सो हियर आटम होगा ए टी ई एम आटम इज योर ब्रेथ सांस की बात कर रहे हो तो आटम आटमेन में बोलना आटमेन इज अर्ब आइन आटमेन आउस आटमेन ब्रीद इन ब्रीद आउट छोड़ना to breathe in to breathe out ein atmen aus atmen yahan saans rokna den atem anhalten hold your sir humne jab sir jab ne verb se humne sikha tha jab wo verb se noun banate hai to das lag jata hai aur wo capitalized ho jata hai us baaki same rehta hai to atmen ka sir breath breath ka to das atmen hona chahiye na sir जो नाउन है नहीं आता ना वो नहीं आता वहां पे आटम आता है अनफॉर्चुनेटली दैट वर्ड आटमेन दस आटमेन जो तुम कह रहे हो वो नॉर्मली आटमेन उसके साथ लग जाता है आत्मा के साथ बट इन द कॉन्टेक्स्ट मतलब वो जो रूल है वो मतलब यूनिवर्सल नहीं है जो ये वो रूल था यूनिवर्सल है Don't use it out of context, because certain words can cause confusion. Just say, "Yahan par hai." Atman e n ke saath chalega, perfect chalega. Arey nahi, wo to atman hai. Haan, thik hai. Atman ke saath chalega, no problem. The other one, my confusion. Sorry, a t m a n is atma. This is e n saas. Chalega, chalega gaye. Ten problem. Yes, sir. And sorry. So the luft order then atem anhalten. That's like my normal way. So, okay, mund aufmachen to close the mouth. Hey, auf. Ah, uh, open, open, open the mouth. Open. Uh, then verband erneuern. Verband. To tie the erneuern. इंस्ट्रक्शन यूल गिव टू अंक एंड बेटा एनोयन जी देन फॉर बन बांध देना नॉय 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 वंस अगेन एनोय 
वंस अगेन नहीं है वर्ड द इम्पोर्टेंट वर्ड हियर इज नॉय क्या मुर्तजा बोलो सर चेंज कर देना पट्टी चेंज करके नई वाली लगा लेना हाँ पट्टी चेंज करो नया नई नई पट्टी बांधो You have to renew. In other words, a new one has to be put there. Ernoyan to refresh, to renew, renew, to make new. Ernoyan. The adjective in that is very clear indication. So please change the bandage. Renew this. Sir, वो ernoid का मतलब once again होता है ना? Ernoid. Ernoid is a new. Dobara. Again, but when you say "ernoyan," it means replace it with a new one. Update the bandage. Okay. And update का क्या मतलब होता है? Data. इशाब मैं ना computer data in ernoyit. So when you say ernoyit here, what does it mean? इशाब the computer data in ernoyit. Updated. है ना एरनोयन विल बी अपडेटेड व्हेन यू से अपडेट तो उसमें क्या आ गया कंप्यूटर में नई चीज आई है कि वही चीज एक बार नहीं नई चीज आई है ना सो एरनोयन टू मेक न्यू बैंडेज के कॉन्टेक्स्ट में बैंडेज बदल दीजिए नया लगाइए नया बांधिए उधर रिप्लेस इट एंड एरनोइट इज अ इज एन एडवर्ब इशाब द अबाउट एरनोइट के मार्क्ड दोबारा किया मैंने वंस अगेन फ्रेश शुरू से एकदम लिटरली एट नॉइट माई बॉस वॉज नॉट हैप्पी विद वर्क सो उसको दोबारा किया दोबारा इन वॉट सेंस राइट फ्रॉम द बिगिनिंग टिल दी एंड इस शब्द एट नॉइट के पास ओके दबलेट इन आउट लिजन So as must man the tablet in embassa auflösen. Disperse or mix. Dissolve in water. Dissolve auflösen to dissolve. Pani me ghol lena isko. So tablet in auflösen dissolve the tablets in water. So you have a meaning of auflösen. Kya matlab hota hai iska? And then does that set nicht vergessen? Of course, this is easy to understand. Yeah, so vergessen has this only one meaning that you already know. But baki ke varied meanings hote hain. So here we are learning them in this context. Over cure for fry machen. Fry machen is to release. But here, over cure plus fry machine, release the upper part of your body. वो कहाँ से release करूँगा? मतलब आप कपड़े तारे शर्ट तारे का इसी में कम नहीं हाँ शर्ट उतार दीजिए. Release it, make it free for me to examine. Mund आप machen, मुँह तो खोलो. That's can't sign for. And a mother feel like some kind. Ja, mach den Mund auf. Wo oh, kommt? Oh, halt die Luft an bitte. Stop the air, stop breathing. Halt den Atem an. Hold the hold your breaths. So context wise, meaning might change, but broadly we have uh, understood what these mean. Adnoit is an adverb. Be careful. Adnoit. The verb is ernoyern. Okay. Infinitive mitsu. एक बार revise करके करेंगे. So let's come back. कितना time है ना थोड़ा बस. Okay. Uh, this is end uh, the lection. On which facts then? So this was virkung, name and virkung and so on. 
लिंटन स्प्रिंगली इन लोगों की सक्सेस स्टोरी है ये शोकोलाडन हेस्टेला that how they would start up with chocolates rudolf springli aman and rudolf lint ye do david springli schwarz und sohn rudolf springli aman 1845 so it's a very very old uh, company very well known very well known and uh, yes we were talking about shar from in essen this was a chapter remember stress on stress hormone kya khana chahiye kya nahi khana chahiye usse pehle frisch gekauft and shar fresh essen juices essen salzige essen um, bitter essen und so weiter कल मैं जाके भूत झोलकिया का चॉकलेट खरीद के लाया हूँ लिंट का नहीं है बट इट्स अ भूत झोलकिया चॉकलेट आई सेंड यू पिक्चर लेटर एंड आई आल्सो सेंड यू राइट राइट अप ऑन स्पाइसी चिलीज विकिपीडिया भूत झोलकिया वाज नंबर सिक्स इट वाज वन नंबर वन वन से पौना टाइम ओके नाउ ये फिल्म देख लेना नेट पे है वो लिंक्स में होगा जो जयंत ने भेजा है कैन यू कंबाइन दीज स्प्रिश व्योरटर करेक्टली एंड स्वाइ ड्राइव या फिल्म और आबे से दे ए Das Auge ist mit. Correct. Der Appetit kommt beim Essen. Correct. Hunger ist der beste Koch. Correct. Hm? मतलब नहीं पता इसका फर एयर बन अभी फील देर कॉक सिंगुलर वी केश प्लोराल फर एस एन ट्रिंकन हेल्ट लीब एंड सील चुसामन इज रिश्तेज लाइबुलट Wo hast du gestern das Brot gelegt oder gestellt? Nicht in den Kühlschrank. Bitte, 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 bitte stell den das Brot oder stell uh, leg das Brot in den Kühlschrank. Sonst verdirbt das Brot. Wenn du das Brot auf dem Tisch liegen lässt, verdirbt das Brot bis morgen. Verdirbt. Dann musst du das Brot wegwerfen. Expire. Spoil. Spoil. Verderben to spoil. Krab ho jana. Now you match them correctly. Das Auge ist mit 
Der Appetit kommt beim Essen. Hunger ist der beste Koch. Essen und Trinken hält Leib und Seele. Leib, das Leib, Body. The complete body. Leib und Seele, this is a phrase. Body and soul. So, Khana or Pina, Apne Sharir or Atma ko bandhe rakta hai. Khushal rakta hai, in that sense. So, feel a kirsha for Derben than Brai. Too many cooks spoil the broths. Up second part of the exercise. ये जो ढूंढे हैं यहाँ पे connections इन पांचों में बिठाओ. Then you have your meaning. Let's take the second one. When man sehr hungrig is, schmeck je des Essen. Hunger is their best koch. Shabash, Arya, well done. If you are hungry, har cheese pasand hai. So when manzea hungry is, shmak dear this essen. Well done. Uh, ye batao, no ma se. Man ist eine speise besonders gern. Wenn sie schön aussieht. Das Auge ist mit. Ist korrekt. Aksar haben wir diese Kräfte, die wir sehen, die wir sehen, die wir sehen. Which is why the plating is very important. If the food looks appetizing, looks attractive, then a person is drawn to it. Khid jata hai. Okay, let's try this one. Mm. So, man muss beginnen, etwas zu tun. Nach einer Weile macht man es dann auch gern. Man muss beginnen, etwas zu tun. Nach einer Weile, after some time, macht man es dann auch gern. Do haben wir solgt, aber अरे काम तो शुरू करो पहले से ही रोना धोना क्यों काम शुरू करो तो काम शुरू करने के थोड़ी देर बाद ठीक लगता है अच्छा लगता है काम मैं यू कंटिन्यू देर एपिटेट कॉम बाय मेस्टर क्या नाउ देर एपिटेट कॉम बाय मेस्टर मेनी पीपल समटाइम्स से ना Ich habe keinen Hunger. Nein, danke, ich will nichts essen. Ich habe keinen Hunger. Lekin, agar thoda sa bhi wo kha le, waap pe fir koi, fir wo rukte nahi hai. They eat more. So, the moment you start eating, your appetite grows. And you definitely want to eat more. So, similarly here, the meaning here, start with something. Are, baut boring hai. Nei karna ho. Are, kar to de thoda sa. Kar ke to dek. When you are coaxing a person, so that push it okay, like you tell your friend. And suddenly you get involved in it. You start liking it to some extent. So man must begin in at was to kind of while much man is done out can. Feele koche for 
Verderbenden Brei. Ja, viele Köche verderben den Brei. Too many cooks spoil the brot. Bohat Brani Kahavat hai. Is that literally Bohat Sare Agar Yellow Cook Ponjke Ek Jagabe Ek Kitchen? So a simple thing like soup, broth. Broth is your uh, water. Basically just the water. Vegetable broth, meat broth, also called stock sometimes. So when too many people are doing the same thing, it's like when Sufi Lepazon by it was mit and scheiden wollen, can this ergebnis nicht gut werden. If you leave too many people to decide something, mit and scheiden, give everyone the same right, then the result will not be good. Tumbi karo, tumbi karo, tumbi karo, and then the end result, gone. And the last one, simple, für das Wohlbefinden ist das wichtig, gut zu essen. Essen und trinken hält Leben und Seele zusammen. zusammen. Wohlbefinden, to feel healthy, to feel good, it is important to eat well and to drink well. So water or whatever you're taking, eat well and drink well. Was without hold. Halten. Okay. Holds. Hold. Huh? Halten is a conjugation. Dritte person singular presence. Halten hielt is preteritum. Gehalten is participle perfect. Halten hielt gehalten. Halten, dritte Person Singular Konjugation, kommt mit dem Umlaut. Und auch die zweite Person Singular, du hältst, kommt mit dem Umlaut. Okay? Als Sora Halka tha, no grammar. I thought nicht gering, ja, both hoga. A little bit of vocabulary fun, a little bit of word building, word formation. Uh, looking for no, grammar ka mein hai nahi aaj. Isliye wala nahi karna mujhe. Infinity Mitsu, I didn't want to do. No grammar exercise. Once in a while, we should have a change. We'll revise this on Monday. And then we'll form sentences with Infinity Mitsu. And we'll go over to other, other things, fast food, slow food, and then all the other um, Parts associated with this lesson. Arya? Yes, sir. You're there still, na? Good. So, ye tumare liye, ye khas kar. Thoda sa modify kar le na isko. First, we write it, Zeus a calorian bombin. Calories from sweets. Sweet calorie bombs. Chocolates. These are full of calories. Bohat jyada calorie hai isme. Ye kuch uh, cooking recipes hai. Try karna chao to try kar lo. <laughs> Thoda apna modification kar lena. Because you may not get all, all the ingredients here. Su tartan. Ingredients means su tartan. So alle su tartan kann man hier vielleicht nicht bekommen. So thode modify karke ye tumare liye. Which recipes? Koch Rezept. Seite Nummer bitte. Seite Nummer 38. Ja, im Lehrbuch, das ist im Arbeitsbuch, nicht im Lehrbuch, im Arbeitsbuch, ja, ja. Seite 38. Ja. Do try it out. So, noch Fragen? Habt ihr noch Fragen? Anyone, any questions?
Keine Fragen? Alles klar? Habt ihr dann alles klar verstanden, was ich erklärt habe? War meine Erklärung klar? Explanations were clear? Yes, sir. So, koi dikkat nahi, koi parishani nahi. Nichts, alles in Ordnung, alles keine Tabletten. Also, wir brauchen keine grammatischen Tabletten heute. Stimmt? Ja. Alles ist gut. Yes, sir. Ja, da ist alles gut. Schön. Dann machen wir hier heute Schluss. Und ich hoffe, alles hat euch Spaß gemacht heute. So, once in a while, I will not be doing grammar 